All right. Right now, we all, uh, we all we would like to talk about checks and balances. Yes. It, that's what life is all about, isn't it? Sometimes <laughs> it's very easy to balance your checkbook, but sometimes other things when it comes to that can be way, way off. Mm hmm And then the banks charge you for it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but they love us, doing that. That's right. But to tell us just a little bit about how you can avoid all the chaos that comes with your banks, maybe keep your uh, finances in line, joining us for her weekly visit, Denise Winston, Time and Money Saving Girl. Thanks for joining us. Yes. Well, you know, it's not just about the fees they charge you. Okay. Um, there is something out there that most consumers don't know about. And the bottom line is common knowledge that we have a credit report and a credit history out mm -hmm. there. Right. Most people don't know that there is actually a bank account history out there and you can get a copy of your report once a year, just like you can with the credit reports by going to um, consumerdebt.com and that's D-B-E-I-T. Okay. Okay. Now, you can get a copy once a year and this is a company called Check Systems that banks use to assess risk of you having an account with them, okay? Okay. All right. Meaning that if you have bounced a lot of checks yeah. and you've left your account overdrawn and you just said, I'm so far in the hole, I can't do this anymore. Can't pay it. You walk away, mm -hmm. you owe them more than $100, it's more than 45 days, they will most likely, and those numbers change, mm -hmm. but they will report you to check systems. Okay. Now, having a report on check systems can be devastating because that means that you may not be able to have an account for up to five years. Oh, boy. Wow. And nobody knows about this until the damage is done. Right. Once the damage is done, the damage is done. So know that this is out there. There's a couple of things that you can do to make sure this doesn't happen. Mm -hmm. You can um, look at your statement every month. Okay. Well, <laughs> you can balance that helps. it. Yes, it helps. <laughs> but you can also set up some overdraft protection. You can get email and cell phone alerts. But I can tell you over my 25 years of banking, this can be devastating for many people because once the record is there, mm -hmm. the record is there. And even if you pay the, back, the money back, they are not obligated to remove you from the service. So is there anything you can do? Can you like maybe contact the service themselves and say, um, like, I've taken care of this? Uh, no. Even if you pay it back, it shows yeah. that it's been paid back. Get a copy of your report by going to the consumerdebt.com. The information on that report is astounding. Mm -hmm. They have all the checks that you've ordered, if you bounced any check, the actual who the, it was paid to. Okay. Um, and who's looking at this? Your banks are looking this to approve you for opening an account. Employers, creditors, uh, government agencies, it's all there. And we really don't know about it as a consumer until it's too late. So get a copy of your report.